What's up guys, welcome back to Road to Dark Aether series. In our last episode, our top comment was from Matt saying he wants us to do the bison. And the bison doesn't exist in this game, so I'm sure he meant the bullfrog. That's what we're gonna be using today. He also said he wants to use the biggest magazine and put dark matter on it, but since he got the name wrong, I'm not putting dark matter on it just because I yeah, I like to see how it looks pack a punch. But we will put the biggest mag uh really quick here. My attachments. We got the suppressor on it for more drop rate, task force barrel, ember sighting point, bruiser grip, 85 round fast mag, elastic wrap, and no stock on it. Also, here is my camo progress. Uh, just like most of the time, we have everything done except for criticals, and we just need about 300 more, so it shouldn't be too bad. So let's go ahead and hop into a game here. Also, I'm using this CDL operator skin. I really like, you know, the vaporwave type thing, if you haven't noticed from the channel already, but I'm gonna be rocking this skin. I like it a lot. Before we get into a game, I do have enough crystals to upgrade everything to max, but somebody was saying that I shouldn't, just so I can start, I can still rack these up before new stuff gets added, if new stuff gets added so i guess i won't upgrade energy mine all the way up i might get all my classes up but i'll leave it where it is all right so we'll hop into a game here and let's go ahead and go on to let's do die machine again i've been liking die machine recently here we go taking uber air into die machine here this guy has no problem landing here but w when there's an exfil and two zombies are left and they're glitched out nowhere near the landing spot he won't be able to land so kind of crazy i think this guy just wants to see us die to be honest i never actually looked through this to see if you can actually see down the stairs through the vines you kind of can pretty cool but anyways uh in cod news they have confirmed that the g11 will be coming out this week i'm not sure what day it could be you know the day i put this video up it could be you know a day after or something but it will be coming this week and i'm pretty sure it's attack rifle i'm pretty sure so we might be able to do that for zombies and get our progress towards our attack rifle so if you guys want to see that let me know also make sure you leave your suggestions on what weapon you want to see me do next we always use top comment on what weapon we're using for dark aether but uh i i would prefer you guys pick something that uh i'm close to getting diamond or or on a class that i haven't gotten diamond yet like the the lmgs the attack rifles the ars and the smgs because if we just go back and do another sniper another melee weapon or like special weapon or something like that it's just not gonna help it's just i mean yeah we'll be getting the gun gold but it's not gonna help our progress towards dark aether once we get dark aether i'll do whatever weapon but for the time being uh i think we just have lmgs attack rifles ars and smgs and that is it so i'm glad we're working on smg here today and i am cod reloading like crazy with the 85 round mag but with the g11 i have seen people play with it uh apparently some people's loadouts have been glitched and they've been able to get it in there and i've seen them like drop it for other people like sam and Lego, and they've used it it looks pretty good so i'm excited to get a new gun into here but also i've been thinking about playing some cod mobile i think from what i've heard you know everyone likes to hate on cod mobile just because it has mobile attached to it but from what i've heard it's like the most complete cod game they have every map every gun and more importantly lots and lots of camos to grind and you know to, to top it all off there's a whole pc version for it like you don't have to just play on you know a phone or a tablet or something they created a whole pc version of it with only pc players to play against so you're not really screwing over mobile players by you know having like better controls or anything so i think once i figure out how to play that uh, i might be grinding some of that out let me know if you guys are interested in seeing that i think regardless we'll at least try a video or two on it but you know you if you guys have been around the channel for a while you know my my favorite thing is to just grind camos like i'll, I'll sit there i'll grind multiplayer camos all day i'll grind zombies camos like that's the most fun part of these games to me so if if cod mobile has all these guns and all these camos that's just fun waiting to happen but with the the g11 drop i'm hoping they they drop standoff with it like they've been teasing standoff they said it's gonna be an in-season drop maybe it comes with the g11 but you know we we've seen them drop guns without like without any other content besides the gun so i guess we'll see we'll stay here for another two rounds and then we'll go turn power on and everything okay so last time we played zombies we were getting the ppsh gold i was talking about the curse of max ammo right now we have no ammo so i am not gonna buy ammo because i know the second i do max ammo will drop so one of these zombies gotta have it on them i'm gonna hit them until it comes out oh insta kill perfect okay all right i guess i will buy ammo because there's no way we're getting two drops in around six but at least we know it wasn't gonna be a max ammo there's no way i'm doing that again i'm pretty sure there's always a drop on round six actually yeah i i don't want to say i'm pretty sure that's literally based off of nothing but it seems like whenever i'm starting to run out of ammo and then i buy ammo to hold me over a max ammo drops instantly so i'm not falling for it again 
I'm not doing it. I know how cheap ammo is too. But it's like, it, it, it's it's the premise of it. I can't just do that to you. And also in the last video, I talked about, uh, I uploaded a bunch of old clips from like uh, Warzone season one onto my TikTok and I completely forgot to link the TikTok. So I'm going to go ahead and put the, the link to my TikTok account. If you guys use that in the description below, if you want to check it out. I, I think the clips are, 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 are pretty funny. Like back early Warzone where you could just mess around, use any gun you wanted. It was awesome. All right, we're at round eight. I'll just grab the insta kill and I'll start making my merry way over to power. We'll buy that, blow this up. We'll do this. And while I'm waiting for that to prime, I'm gonna come up here and get my loose change. There we go. Later, fellas. Oh wait, I have insta kill. I can just do this. Okay, now I'm gone. Okay, no zombies have spawned over here yet. Lay down, quick loose change start the opening on this farm a few crits off these guys so while they're nice and lined up for me oh there's a max ammo and now we're going in now is it me or does this facility here without power get darker within the last like few days i feel like i cannot see anything you that or like the flashlight is not working like you see normally there's a flashlight attached like this but whenever i aim it up it has not been working i don't know if it's like a game settings thing or what but the last few times i've played on here it seems like the flashlight only works when i point it down did they nerf the flashlight loose change Ooh, watch the movement. Watch the movement. Hop the railing. Hop whatever that is. Hurdle the zombie. Hit the button. Hit the railing. Come on, anomaly. There we go. Heading into the aether. All right, I'm not even going to say it this time. You guys already know what I think about this. You know it looks good in here. You know. Give me a perk. Please. I'm just going to buy a quick revive just in case. Quick little insurance policy. And I guess I'll get stamina up. Get this. Monkey bombs. Two monkey bombs. That's pretty good. Dang, a lot of monkey bomb drops out of these. No perks, though. Let's get our pack-a-punch part. Quit being greedy. Oh, I never grabbed our, our loose change from here. There's no time to waste. And there we go. Get in there. It's another crit. Let's get enough to pack so we can get that out of the way. We need to kill one more zombie. I think there's only one left, too. Where you at? Oh, he's up here. Taking his time. My bitch. Oh, we're still a little short. And I think we've gotten all the loose change we can. Well, that's not true. But we need to buy a door to get more. We can do the Easter egg. Maybe get some points out of some crystals. And then we'll be chilling. There we go. Bye-bye, puppy. Whoa, they're doing the coffin dance. Have you guys ever seen this? We have enough to pack, but there'll be plenty of time once uh, that Easter egg ends. Let's go see if we can get some free perks. Oh, we got some essence, though. Okay, give me perks. Nope, that's just a nade. Nothing there. Nothing out of that one, either. Some armor. Our armor's already full, though. No, it's ending. Any perks here? Nope, we got some essence. Double essence right before it ended. Now, somebody left a comment. Uh, his name is Kumar, saying if you wait for this little guy to turn gold before you hit it. Oh, it turned blue the last second. Okay. It did work the first time I did it. But if you turn it gold, you wait till the, the, the face is gold, you have a better chance of getting a legendary weapon. So maybe I hit it too early, too late. That could be user error. But the first time I tried that, after I read that comment, it worked. I got a ray gun instantly. So uh, the little smiley face on the on the Easter egg boxes actually means something. Uh, we got we got jug, we got stamina up, we got quick revive. And all we got to do is basically get crits at this point. And we got a big daddy coming. I really need to upgrade this weapons tier. Uh-oh, we're getting stutters. We get green, we get blue. Back out. There we go. Get off me. There's Big Papa. He's angry. And he's already split. Uh-oh. This thing's kind of messing us up. Let's go here. And just ring a fire it out. Oh, yeah. They're getting slapped. Come on. Don't be shy. Come get critted. Is that the round? Might as well be. I'm hitting the nuke. Nothing left for us. We just need to double our crits and we're good to go. We do have 5k though. Let's go ahead and get an ammo mod. We can do that. I'll get cryo. And then we'll just stay down here. This is probably the easiest spot for crits. As long as I don't go down. We do not make any mistakes anymore. There's no more buying jug before doing the Easter egg. There's no more going down to anything stupid. None of that. We don't even, we don't go down anymore. It, it does not happen. It does not exist. All we do is just get crits that's it and we're racking them up too they can't stand us we'll do our service go ahead and fix up the barricade putting our time in i know i have two monkey bombs right now but i honestly feel like monkey bombs are not that great in this like yes they do attract all the zombies over and they do kill like most if not all zombies that go to it 
when it takes so long to throw it's like not worth it but i will keep it on just for the sheer fact that we got two of them back to back out of crystals this is a slight work quick max ammo we do have enough to pack a punch again but i think we need perks where's the anomaly at is it up in penthouse let's go check i can't see it from down here no it's out here okay let's hit the anomaly so we can go to the wonder jizz we can grab dead shot dead shot and then speed cola and we're good could get elemental pop too but it's not necessary there we go let me just chill here easy crits hold on let's ring a fire while we still got a little bit of ammo in the mag oh yeah we're slaughtering i don't even gotta say it dude just look at it you know you know that it looks good we gotta be getting close here on crits we're only like a hundred away i'm pretty sure maybe even less so i think we might be able to get it done this round also i don't know how many of you guys play nintendo type games and all that but pokemon snap came out the other day i've been having a blast with that i think we might stream that sometime soon so if you guys are interested make sure you check over on the twitch twitch.tv slash jmon3y26 like I, I'm, I'm a huge pokemon fan i never really got to enjoy pokemon snap when it first came out but we have it now and it's it's good i like it a lot oh leaving the aether goodbye jellyfish I love you. All right, the next three kills here. It's it, it's got to be gold. Watch this. Watch the gold pop up. Wait for it. Uh oh, we got Big Daddy and he's gone. He can't handle us. A club can't even handle me right now. The penthouse can though. Jeez, Ring of Fire is kind of crazy. I forgot how good it is. Like Ring of Fire is saucy. There we go. Oh, we do have an exfil ready. Is that the round? Yeah, it's got to be. Can we finish it and still make the exfil this round? I feel like we can. It's gonna be a buzzer beater, but we can get it. Okay, well, it's a dog round. We might be able to go pack a punch. I just gotta be quick. I don't want the axe fill to expire. I'm pretty sure it expires towards the end of the round of 16. Okay, we got pack two. Gotta just eliminate all those dogs. Oh, it is. Oh, it's still here. I'm, a, I'm an idiot. I thought it just popped up. I still don't have gold. I can't leave. Okay, there's our max ammo. I'm gonna sit right over here. Please don't go away, radio. Can we get it while we axe fill, actually? Should we do that? We need 40 kills. Oh, I'm scared. Should I do it? I don't want to not get it gold. I feel like it'll work. Let's just, let's get a few here. So I know we're close. Okay, I'm hitting it. Okay, exfil started. I just need to get nothing but crits while we try to exfil. And unless I actually need 400. If I actually need 400, I'm going to be kind of mad. No, there it is. Okay, we get, we're getting gold viper on the way out. Perfect. Oh, no. That was so close. Get off me. Oh, yeah, we're slaying. One zombie left. Oh, they're all gone. I have had a problem where zombies will spawn inside of this and you can't shoot into it. But we didn't have that problem this time. We got gold on the x -fill. That's just perfect. The perfect way to get out of here. Very efficient. Only took us 289 crits. We probably got a little extra than we needed. That still wasn't wasn't too bad. Very quick. Ooh, we just got the Masterclass MP5. All right, let's take a look at this in Gold Viper. Boo boo. That is awful. That is not even worth putting it on the gun. I'd keep a default. Plague Diamond looks good. They always have really good coverage on Plague Diamond. The coverage on Dark Aether is not good either, but at least the camo is. We just need three more SMGs for Plague Diamond on that. And then how many more ARs do we need? Let's check. So I don't have the XM4 done, but I have a, a good bit of it. We need four ARs. What else do we need? Where are my tack rifles at? We need three more tack rifles. I think we need the RPD. Yep, RPD. We have snipers done, pistols done, shotguns done, launchers done, melees done, and specials. We still have like DLC weapons to do for a lot of these classes, but they're not going to help us get to Dark Aether. So if you're going to suggest a weapon, please, please, an assault rifle, SMG, attack rifle, or the RPD. Those are the choices. Any other choice, I might just have to go and throw it out. I mean, we might still do it for another video, but we got we to gotta get Dark Aether soon. I'm itching. I need another mastery camo. I, this one feels like we're taking too long. If you like this video, you want to see more, make sure you leave a like on it. If you didn't, you don't. Dislike. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. We're still on the road to 100k. And uh, that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.